Too much sugar is uh, one of the most uh, common things that I find uh, that causes people to gain weight. Um, the awesome thing about it is learning how to reduce that sugar is also the easiest way to lose weight. All right, let's get started. things uh, individually and actually look at the sugar content in them um, so that we can actually see it uh, with our own eyes. And All right, first off, how much sugar should we be eating maximum per day? Uh, the American Heart Association recommends that it's 25 grams uh, per day maximum for women, uh, 37.5 grams maximum for men, and 25 grams maximum uh, for children, that's ages 2 to 18. But a rough kind of average of all of that equals 30 grams per day. It's something that's easy to remember. Uh, so for this video, we're going to go from here on out with the maximum recommended sugar intake being 30 grams per day. Okay, guess how much sugar? And the answer is 64 grams. This is a single 20 ounce Mountain Dew, 77 grams of sugar. This is a Starbucks Double Shot Energy and it has 26 grams of sugar per can. Quick side note on reading uh, labels. You can see that the sugars say 21 grams. So up here, and if we look at servings per, per container, we actually see that there are two and a half servings in a single container. I think oh, I'm just drinking 21 grams of sugar when actually you're getting uh, 52 and a half grams because it's actually two and a half times that. You know, it's obviously enticing for kids and uh, you know, my son would totally run over here and grab this thing. It says things like 100% juice, no added sugar. Your fruit, which contains a lot of the true nutrients and the fibers, uh, has been discarded and we basically just kind of pull the sugar water out. Breaking myths, juice is not healthy. Another good example of just understanding the uh, serving size. Just above my thumb, sugars says 23 grams. Servings per container, four. 23 grams times four, we have almost 100 grams of sugar in this single container. This is a uh, blueberry yogurt. You often uh, times find yogurt has quite a bit of sugar in it and you really have to take a look uh, specifically at the sugar label. So how does sugar cause us to gain weight? Well, if we take this Mountain Dew as our example, if you remember that it had 77 grams of sugar, 
and we know that one gram of sugar has four calories, we can calculate how many calories are in one single Mountain Dew. So if we were to drink one Mountain Dew per day for one week, then we would get Now if we take that many calories and multiply it times 52 for 52 weeks in a year, we will see how many calories we would gain per year. So that's 112,000 calories um, per year from drinking one regular pop per day. Now we know that for every 3,500 calories, uh, that we take in above our normal nutrient needs, uh, we gain one pound of excess weight. We can take the number of calories per year divided by 3,500 to figure out how many pounds per year that we would gain from drinking one pop per day. So that's 32 pounds per year from drinking uh, one pop per day. Uh, the awesome thing about this that I think is the most important is to realize that stopping um, one pop per day can lead to losing uh, 32 pounds in a year without making any other changes. See, this is just one example. You can use those numbers for any type of uh, snack or other type of thing that you'd want to calculate how many. All right, and that's our video. Um, I hope you found it useful. I hope you can uh, use those techniques and uh, we'll see you soon. All right, thank you.